Hi, Taurus. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Okay, hold on. <coughs> yeah, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Uh, it means a lot. Um, and thank you to all who all who already like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. Ooh, let me. Somebody does not want this message out. Oh. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so let's see what's going on here. <coughs> So the cards that I pull off camera for you are <clears throat> deciding to accept the BS relationship. Hashtag I give in. Okay. So some of you are just deciding to accept some BS and your person knows that um, you deserve so much more than I'm giving. I'm sorry. So there's an energy where somebody is like, um, I don't know if they if they have pushed your back against the wall or maybe you they've got you feeling like this is what you deserve or this is you know as good as it gets they know that they need to give you so much more but they aren't either at a place where they can or they want to and we're gonna clarify that uh work gets rewarded do the work some of you need to do the work on yourself on your business on your job on your body on your you know, your family dynamic, your family relationships, friend relationships. We're going to clarify what this is, but do some work because work gets rewarded. Okay. And they want you to know to whom much is given, much will be required. Period. All right. So, um, you may have been given some innate talent. Like maybe you're just good at leadership or you're good at talking or you're good at, you know, oration, um, to to much to whom much is given, much is required. I also heard alms for you. So some of you need to do your benevolent work. You need to give back. You need to do something that you know you're not getting something in return. It's just you giving. Okay, you need to do that freely. You need to do that on a, a schedule, fr frequent schedule. Okay, frequent schedule. All right, that's what they say. I don't know. <clears throat> Deciding to accept the BS relationship. Who or what is deciding to accept the BS relationship? What is going on here? Okay. Uh, Leo, maybe you're dealing with a Leo or you're deciding to accept some, maybe some hidden relationship, um, some for, forbidden relationship where you have to tame your emotions here. You have to tame how you feel. Um, you can't really trust this person or you don't trust this person. It could be a sex only type of situation or relationship here. It could be something where you guys just meet up maybe for a drink date and have sex again. Um, you're just deciding to accept this type of relationship for whatever reason. Maybe, you know, reasons that only, you know, why let's see what else. Um, yeah, you decided to accept this, this person just giving when they can, you know, you waiting and they just giving you whatever they can give you, maybe even giving you money, um, giving you a little bit of money or enough money, but not, but you know, not enough to where you can just, you know, you know, you're wealthy. Some of you could be, you know, engaging in pay for play. Some of you could be exotic dancers or entertainers. So, um, someone feels like they just need to pay you every time they see you, uh, maybe for sexual activity. Someone's trying to show their affection by way of gifts or money. <clears throat> Somebody is in a power seat here like, okay, well, you got to wait on me or you wait on me or you wait for me to call you and give you a time, a place. Some of you are decided to accept this BS relationship that it could be that the sex is, you know, dwindling. If somebody doesn't want to have sex as much in the relationship, somebody's keeping money to themselves or hoarding or keeping energy to themselves or they always keep you chasing after them or wanting more wanting more of their time energy effort love you want validation they keep you chasing their validation that ain't right you deserve so much more than i am giving i'm sorry all right let's see let's clarify that <clears throat> the page of cups that's all they're giving and giving just you know sweet nothings in your ear 
you know, um, dreams, hopes, promises. But, you know, the page of cups says, you know, follow your dreams. You can't just be so wishful. This person is just giving you dreams. They're giving you a fish in a cup, you know, nothing. You know, they can even fry the fish up or nothing. They're just giving you a fish in a cup. Um, it, it's just, you know, it's sorry. It's very sorry. All right, one more card for, you know, th they may even give you an apology, okay? That's about it. it they're stringing you along, the six of wands here. You know, they may even give you that apology to string you along so you can say, okay, they apologize. You know, they, they mean well or they mean better or they want better for us. But they're not doing it. They just want you to continue to keep, you know, be in the parade of that, you know, that they're, you know, hosting, that they have put on. They're parading around like they want more with you or they're going to give you more or give you an, an engagement or something like that. They just aren't. <clears throat> work gets rewarded. What do you need to work on? Since this is your reading, Taurus, what does Taurus need to work on? Five of Pentacles, you need to work on your money. Um, you may be in a temporary place of, you know, uh, robbing Peter to pay Paul, check to check. You need to work on saving. You need to work on, this could even be uncertain, you know, self-employment. Some of you spin, spin, spin. And you just need to do more work, more opportunity to gain money because that's how we get money, right? Doing work, whether you do hard work or easy work, you do something to get that that you know green stuff or whatever color your money is wherever you are um the five of pentacles says you're in a temporary state of lack temporary state of lack temporary state of lack let it be temporary don't let it rest with you too long do some work to get yourself out of that you could sell something you could uh put something on consignment you could pawn something you could do anything you know you can get yourself out of that temporary place of lack okay what else do we have here work gets reward yeah king of wands for some of you it is going to be entrepreneurial endeavor there could be some unexpected income coming your way unexpected money good luck also um you need to delegate you need to go after your dreams okay you need to make it happen um you could be helping someone out also I heard somebody coming to live with you and helping out. I don't know where I'm... Okay. <clears throat> yeah, someone could be looking towards you to come and live or you have the money. Maybe that's what this piggyback... Of, you may be telling somebody else they need to do some work. You know what I'm saying? So that they could get the money. Some of you need to do work on, on your dreams or whatever you're trying to institute or bring into fruition. You need to do more work. The wands are about doing. And it says, do the work. So, yeah, some of you need to do more. Um, to whom much is given, much is required. So, let's see. Back to somebody trying to come live with you and they need something from you or you have more than enough. To whom much is given, much is required. To whom much is given, much is required. Six of Swords. Yeah, somebody's trying to, they're leaning on you. They're leaning on you for money or leaning leaning on you for a place to live or something of that nature. Yeah, Eight of Pentacles, they might be down on their luck. They see that you have it. They see that you have a lot in reserve. You have a lot stored up. So they're like, hey, you might need to do some benevolent work also. You know, you might need to just do this one thing for this one particular person or you might need to find stranger and do something for stranger not saying that you need to bring a stranger in your home but you know buying a meal giving some money giving some clothes giving some socks giving some shoes whatever it is you need to do um because you've got a lot you've got a lot in reserves here you've been working very hard for it um you need to do your alms you need to be prudent with your money give it to things or people who will actually need it need it not want it not um desire it not covet your money but yeah need it um you need to do something um big okay ace of pentacles you've got a lot the universe is presenting you an opportunity to give back if you don't see the opportunity it says look again you get the opportunity to start your own own business and do it right you get the opportunity to come out of some turbulent chaotic lifestyle or um turbulent chaotic work environment to move with somebody maybe moving with someone asking to move with someone to whom much is given much is required someone will say yes someone's got enough for you or enough stored up 
to where they can, uh, you know, they can say yes to you. They can give you what you need in, in your time of need if you are in need or vice versa. You have enough so you can give someone else what they need in their time of need. Let's see what the Butterfly Oracle card has to offer you. And we'll close out. Let's see. Oh, dang it. All right. Um, you're stronger than you know. You're stronger than you're giving yourself credit for. Okay. You can actually make this happen. You can actually do this. You can actually walk away. You can actually give. You can actually move. You need to make some decisions. But they need to all be about you. Self-care. You need to rest. You're not, not sleep, but rest. You're just going, going, going. Okay, you need to change your mind or your mind may be changing about a specific person, place, or thing. Keep the faith that you can get what you want. Don't be so desperate for something that you'll accept anything because some of you are deciding to accept the BS relationship. This is what I have for you, Taurus. If it resonates, go over to the website, book your own reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, go over to here on YouTube. Go to the community tab first. Grab a discount code and then go over to the website and book your reading there. Thank you, Taurus. Many blessings to you. Take care.